what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And getting ready to bring you this European Championship group stage game. It's Germany, and they take on Sweden. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. But nothing comes of it. I always think, Stuart, with Tony Kors, we're talking about a player who's absolutely... Oh, what a great chance this is, Derek. Now it comes to... Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Long way out this. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck... He's at... As eyes for goal! Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. Max. How can they make one of these passes count? Must be! And a goal! That will do it! They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Oh, good-looking run. Could be. And another one. Two quick goals. Will it turn out to be the two-punch knockout? Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots yeah, of pressing pressing has been excellent. And they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolute... Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Keep it. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. in the offing our cameras on one man in fantastic form and leading the competition in goals. Stay with us on EA TV. Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And on the menu, this European Championship group stage encounter. It's Wales versus Germany. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. I'm expecting to see exactly the same again today. Can he convert? Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. Making sure it didn't get past him. Werner. 
Werner. On to Gnabry. And the keeper's in trouble. Oh, and that is an audacious chip. Well, he might smile. The goalkeeper has no interest in smiling. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And just look at the finish. That's a brilliant piece of skill and vision to chip the goalkeeper from there. What a great goal. Promising possession, this. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how... Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. And will it be the leveller? Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. And he's through here. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. Going well. the crossbar he's got the right idea with that pass defending by example and oh it's in we cannot declare this contest over they still believe well here you can see what a good goal this is he hits it so cleanly and the we keeper has well he could run onto it here oh he could be in trouble Well, not a red card, just a yellow. Interesting one, Stuart. Well, I have to say, I think the referee's got that absolutely right. He takes aim. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and we're just moments away from kickoff time. Stay tuned for the live action. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you is this European Championship group stage confrontation. It's Germany up against Finland. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Might be able to get in behind the defence, but nothing comes of it. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Mark andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Matthias Ginter plays with Antonio Rüdiger in central defence. Toni Kroos starts alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan. Terrific save. Well, that's a top-class save. He read it so well. Gundogan, can they forge ahead? They do, and you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, as you can see, what an excellent backfield this is to set up the goal, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace, the keeper has no time to react. Can they create something from here? And return to Gnabry. Max. Gnabry! They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. 
Well, the stats confirm that Germany have had the lion's share of possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the oh, game Stuart, goes on. They could be in here. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then what a strike. That's it with such ferocity. Certainly no... Zan. Max. Into the advanced position. And he's made headway. And a close offside decision as they were threatening. Himalayan. Defensive efficiency personified. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Gundogan. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? The cameras are fixed to one man. The competition's top marksman. Stay with us on EA TV as he tries for more. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you this European Championship quarter-final. It's Germany, and they take on Belgium. Well, Derek, these two teams will be fully aware of what's at stake. A place in the semi-final of this great competition. It should be feisty, it should be entertaining, and it should be full of quality. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Well, that pass easy on the eye. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. Goku. He's given it straight to the opposition. And he could be in proper trouble here. And it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. In with a chance. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Can they take advantage? Just needs to stay calm. There it is! A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, here it is again. What a ball that is over the top of the defence. It's weighted perfectly and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one foot in his head. Smash Gundogan. Looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Of course. Max. He'll try his luck here. Well, here it is again, and wow, just take a look at this. He's absolutely nailed this one. What a strike that is from distance. And let's give credit to the defending. Oh, lovely incisive pass. And the keeper throws himself up the ball. 
They take it short. Well, he has players waiting at the back post. He quartered the attack illegally. Now, perhaps a card is forthcoming. And the yellow card for that, Stewart. Body in the way. Azar. Now Lukaku. And the keeper tied into thwarting. Max. This is Kroos. Gnabry. Well, flinging himself at it. Kroos. And did his job defensively. Zan. Kroos. Opportunity here. It's in. And this really takes your brother away. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace. Gundogan. Can they convert? Denied by the ball. Back in play here. And not a great challenge. Free kick here. Well, he's had his name taken by the referee. Well, he knew he was going to get booked. It's a poor tackle, really. Is that for the first half here? Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And then there were four. Both teams have dazzled and delighted us throughout. But who will make it to the European Championship final? Stay tuned for the answer. We're live next on EA TV. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And we're just moments away now from kickoff time in this European Championship semi final. It's Portugal versus Germany. Well, what an occasion this should be, Derek. Two excellent teams, two top coaches, a great atmosphere, and 90 minutes away from a place in the cup final. It should be a classic. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks, and Andre Silva is the lone striker. Diogo Jota. Andre Silva. What well, as he hit that one, it looked as though it had a chance. It did look on for them, but not to be. Gundogan. Zan. This looks more than decent. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. It's a short corner. And delivered towards the back post. And off the post. But the assistant referee has his flag raised. Serge Gnabry. Zan. They might be able to get in now. And there it is! The first goal of the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, we can see it again now, and it all starts with the pass over the top. It takes out so many defenders, but I think the keeper's made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. Ginter. 
Tony Kors. Fruitful looking attack. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. For the sake of it, they need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Bruno Fernandes. Real chance. And a goal to square the game. Into the seat stuff. Well, here's the replay, and you just have to admire the patience of the passing as they look for that defence splitting ball, and it makes the strike. Zan. Good visualisation and execution. Needs to clear it away. Gives it a go. The body in the way. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. And fired over by course. No nonsense clearance. Ginter. Gnabry. Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss the by mentions. much. A really sumptuous ball. Guerrero, Bruno Fernandes, Jota, real chance, a goal, well still a long way to go in this one, but could it be one foot in the final, if the celebrations are anything to go by, the fans believe that's the case. Well here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing, one touch, slick movement, and it is official the hosts are going to the final well it was far from easy at times they'll certainly know they've been in a